Yeah. So I was knocked out, and uh, I don't know what happened. I I had been going, <clears throat> you know, just about every day down there to play, and I was young. I was fast. I could jump. I was, you know, dunking on the Marines. Maybe they got mad at me. The um, basketball court was a little strange. It had this cement curb around the outside for some reason. And I'm just wondering, did I hit hit that? Anyway, woke up in the hospital. Uh, my folks were panicked looking for me. Finally, I, I woke up and gave them a little information because I had no ID on me at all. And... Uh, so that was that uh, interesting part of my life. So couldn't walk right. I had a heavy limp. Well, my whole left side of my face, I got hit on the right here. And the whole left side of my face was saggy and I couldn't talk right. But, you know, I was a bartender and uh, <laughs> student teaching. And so went back and, and did my best, but I was I was kind of jacked up for a, for a while. When I got back to the you know at Rubens where I bartended, uh, the Chargers Dan Fouts were doing really well in 1983, and so it was fun to to work the brunches, and uh, the game was on, and you made a lot of cash. You know you had uh, come home with a bunch of ones. I have to go to the bank and deposit my cash because my pockets were full of ones uh, from the tips. And in the evenings, they had music. And uh, different acts came in, but this one girl, she was pretty good, and she uh, sang Scotch and Soda, the Kingston Trio song. And she did a good job of it. And then she wrote down the chords for me. And I, I don't use those chords anymore kind of arranged it for myself, you know, these days, but uh, here we go, let's try scotch and soda, try to do it one take, scotch and soda, blood in your eye, baby do I feel high, oh me oh.
So, yeah. Uh, bartending, jacked up. I remember Dave Small. He was on our basketball team. He came into the bar, sat down, and he started talking to me. And I said, <laughs> and tell him, you know, I don't recognize who you are. Because I was, I was messed up. And, you know, certainly I should have known Dave Small. So, Dave, if you ever see this, sorry. There's a reason for that. Also, Bird got married, and uh, I got uh, pulled over by the police, making kind of an erratic exit off in Santa Barbara after we had his wedding uh, uh, the party, the reception, was on the Constellation, which is that boat that burned and killed all those people out of the Channel Islands. Well, this is back 1982, three, I guess, and... Uh, yeah, so I got pulled over by the cops, and I wasn't drunk, but they thought I was because <laughs> I didn't walk right or talk right. Muck came out and saved me. Muck went to me, this guy's had a concussion, that's why he's... And they finally gave me a breathalyzer and had to let me go. <laughs> Fun story. Bye.